Yo, what's up guys? It's Uballo here, back with a brand new video. In today's video guys, I'm going to go over the top 5 settings to use in Season 4. A lot of you guys were asking me what are the best settings in Season 4. So in this video, I'm going to go over the top 5 pro controller settings to use. It will be linear or exponential. There's a mixture of both in this list. So if you guys just want a linear and just an exponential, let me know in the comments below. I can do that. But in this video, it's going to be, be a mix of which I think are the best settings to use. I have 5 different pro controller player settings in this video. And I will be showing off the settings too. So you guys are trying to use them, you guys can in this video. But yes, hope you guys enjoy. And if you're new here, make sure you subscribe and turn on post notifications. Run that 60k grind. So you subscribe, I'd appreciate it a lot. Also, so make sure you just drop a like down below and for 500 likes on today's video we haven't hit 500 likes in a long time so make sure you smash that like button down below but i hope you guys enjoy let's hop right in the five spot all right guys at the number five spot today we have innocence he's a really good controller player he actually plays on xbox and he's been good for a super long time i've actually used the settings a couple times if you guys have watched those videos so i had to put him on here recently on my last video if you guys don't know i did this one every season i actually put him at the number one spot but his settings haven't been feeling the greatest for me so i have him at the number five spot today and for his settings they are for his settings he runs 2.8 and his edit mode is 3.1 a little higher so that's why i kind of made him drop a little bit look horizontal speed is 44 look vertical speed is 41 pretty good there ADS look horizontal speed is 8 ADS look vertical speed is also 8 he's a linear player like i said it's a mixture of both but he's a linear moose dead zone is 8 and look stick dead zone is 6 so guys these are his settings you guys are going to try and try them out that's number five spot let's hop into number four all right, guys, at the number four spot today, we have FaZe Sway. As you guys know, I'm assuming all you guys know who he is. He's a really good control player. He's been good forever. Was the first person to actually start doing the building era during, like, maybe everyone good. He has over three mil subs on YouTube. I'm assuming you guys have seen, like I said before. That's why I put his settings on here because he's really good. And everyone knows him. Everyone likes his settings. I've actually used one of his settings. I actually used his settings for a video and got over 400k views. I don't know if you guys remember those days. But, yeah, so his settings were really good. So, I highly recommend you guys trying out. And if you guys do use him, you guys might turn on like this. So, I mean, you might become cracked like FaZe Sway. But here is the settings right here. All right, guys, these are face away settings right here. So for his build mode sense, 2.4. End mode sense is 2.3. Pretty good. I kind of like that a lot. Look horizontal speed is 47. Look vertical speed is also 47. Really in that range. So really good setting so far. 80s look horizontal speed is 15. 80s look vertical speed is also 15. Pretty good. And then he uses linear. And then for his dead zone, he runs 5 and 5. Also, guys, just letting you guys know, Sway does play Claw. So, I mean, these settings not be, might, might not be perfect for you. So if you guys play Claw, these might be really good. But if you don't, just letting you guys know a little warning. But yeah, let's hop in number 3. Alright guys, at the number 3 spot today, we have Unknown Army, Energy, Unknown Army. I'm assuming you guys know who he is, another really good player. All these people on this list are really good controller players. So, but if you guys don't know, Unknown Army actually is on PC or keep on a mouse, but he's actually started playing a controller more. So I had to put him on here just because I really like the settings, and I actually used the settings for his last video, for my last video, so I tried him out and they are really good, so I had to put him on the list, because I actually did go crazy with them. But yes, Unknown Army settings are really good, easy control, really smooth, if they are exponential settings. But yes, the settings are exponential, so I'm just a little warning for his settings right there. But here are his settings right here. For Unknown Army settings, his build mode sense is 2.2, edit mode sense is 2.2. Look horizontal speed is 53, look vertical speed is 46. His ADS look horizontal speed is 16, ADS look vertical speed is also 16. His look input curve is linear, and then for his dead zone, he runs 10 and 8. Pretty good settings, everything except for exponential, like really good settings. But you guys, it's hopping around two spot, and we're almost getting to the end. Alright guys, at the number 2 spot today, we have Leteshi. If you guys don't know who he is, like I said in this video, all you guys are go to controller players. So I had to put him on here. Really good player. He's an EU player. Really good. I've actually used the settings a couple times. You guys actually really liked him. So I had to put him on here and I really like his settings. I actually used them recently in Season 4 and they actually were really good. His settings are a little weird, but they actually work. It's kind of surprising. But you guys, these are the settings right here. Alright guys, so for Leteshi's settings, his build mode sense is, is 1.6, his edit mode sense is 1.3. Like I said, it's kind of weird, it's lower, but then for his look horizontal speed is 72, and look vertical speed is 82. Just kind of reverse, kind of reverse rolls. 80's look horizontal speed is 11, and vertical speed is also 11. He's a linear player, and then for the dead zone is 10 and 7, so yeah, these are Leteshi's settings. A little weird settings, but they actually work. I highly recommend you guys trying these settings out, but you guys, let's hop in the number one spot. Alright guys, at the number one spot today, we have the one and only Wolfies. If you guys don't know who he is, like I said, another really good player. The settings are insane in Season 4. I highly recommend you guys trying them out. I hope you guys enjoy. These settings are really good. If you guys want to use anyone on the list, make sure you try out Wolfies. Wolfie settings are amazing. Definitely one of my favorites of all time. But you guys, if you guys are wondering, here are the settings right here. 
Furious settings, his build mode is 2.7, end mode is 2.9, really good. Look horizontal speed is 47, look vertical speed is 39. Kind of like it evens out each other, so I kind of like that. And then for his 80s, look horizontal speed is 8, and vertical speed is also 8. Makes it lower, so it's really easy to aim. And then look input curve is linear, so like you said, he's a linear player. And then his move stick dead zone is 6, and look stick dead zone is 6. So you guys, these are his settings, and I hope you guys enjoyed that video. These are Wolfie settings. Alright guys, I hope this video helped you guys out on so what settings to use in Season 4. Let me know Let me know in the comments below which ones you guys are going to try out and which ones you like the most. But I hope you guys enjoy, but... Alright guys, hope you guys enjoyed. I love you guys. Make sure you just like, comment, subscribe, and peace them out. And I'll catch you guys in my next one.